What up y'all and welcome back to another one. We're out here, central Kansas, for another snow goose hunt. Today is the second day of conservation. Yesterday we hunted morning and evening and actually made two videos out of it. I hope that you guys have been liking the Kansas snow goose hunting so far. I'm really enjoying being home, chasing Whitey. But today we have right at an eight man hunt, I believe. It's either seven to nine people, I believe it's eight. It's sitting at 29 degrees. We have a north wind that is steady 15 mile an hour with like 20, 22 mile an hour gusts. I think it's supposed to maintain about 14 to 18 miles an hour today. So that is good news. The snow goose hunting should be decent today, y'all. It's supposed to be partly cloudy and we are gonna sit an absolute unit today. We're gonna get up as many as we can. We got here about an hour earlier. It's sitting right at five o'clock. We have just under two hours until shooting light. <sighs> as you can tell, I'm excited. I have a massive idea for a spread. Uh, it's gonna be big. She's gonna look good today, boys. That's all I gotta say. Well, here we go. We got the side by side today and a lot of snow goose decoys, boys. We got two uh, ATVs, two trailers full. We're gonna try to sit 200 dozen today. Woo! We have a sea of decoys out, y'all. We got well over 200 dozen out. Uh, we just watched a trailer pull in a field south of us about 30 minutes before shooting light, so. Things could get interesting today, let's just say that. Are you ready? I'm ready. Hopefully, uh... You gotta yell! I'm ready! Oh, Freddy, you ready to go, buddy? Huh? You ready to go? We're ready to go, the birds are up. Birds are up! This could get interesting, I'm telling you, this spread is massive. I'll show you more of it here in just a little bit. Lay down, boys. Lay all the way down. Look how you look. Whoa. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> These pintails. Crazy, man. There's so many pintails in Kansas right now, it's insane. Those are white. Those are white, get ready. No. This left group's white. Yeah, they're white. Right. Yep. Can I shoot them there? Or do you want to wait for this group? Yeah, let's let them work. We'll shoot the two. Oh, they did it really good. If you like the video so far, you know what to do. Smash that thumbs up for me. Come on, baby. Start spinning. Come on, baby. Well, we got a lot of birds, gentlemen and gals. Lay down, Fred. Lay down. Be picky on your shots, guys. Watch what you're shooting. Those low ones keep going. These ones oh, yeah, yeah. Yep, yeah, these ones look good, boys. They're all juvies, aren't they? Shoot up! Ah! <laughs> 
a few. Here, Fred! Dead bird! Oh, those, those are specs. Those are specs. Dead bird! Dead bird, here! Let's go, buddy! Come on! Here, here. Dead bird, dead bird. Dead bird. There we go. We dropped a handful. Here we go. Get ready on these. Hey, careful on those specs. Take one shot and know what you're shooting. Pick white. Shut up! Here, heel, 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 heel. For a dead bird, dead bird, dead bird. Woo! Well, uh, there is someone hunting just south of us across the road. I don't think they've shot um, these birds. There's a lot out here. We have not shot one adult bird. They're all juvies. The only birds that like to give it up are the juvies. Good boy, see? That's a juvie. Good boy, Fred. Come here, we got one more, buddy. Dead bird, dead bird. Dead bird. Woo. Well, no one ever said that snow goose hunting was easy. No matter how many decoys you put out, I'm telling you, the adults, they're so hard, they just stay at 150 yards and go right over the top of us. The only thing we shot is juvies. That's the only thing that's giving it up today. You can tell the older birds, even if they're a middle-aged bird, they'll stay at 70 yards and just look at you and look at you. Very, very, very tough. You know, everybody has a theory that no plugs, no limits, use an e-collar, that it makes everything so much easier. That's not the case. It's all about what birds you're hunting, to be honest. Young birds, that's the ticket. Shoot up! One got away! Good boy, Fred! Here! Buddy. Hi, bird. Oh, he got. 
got tore up, dude. Disintegrated. All because of you. Those Rosses are loving it. There we go. Get ready. Get ready. What do you think? <laughs> oh gosh. Oh geez. Hold on a minute. These juvies are gonna hang out. There we go. Let me tell you. That's a juvie blue. Yeah, buddy. Make sure they're not banded. Not banded. Good, here. That's an older bird. Good boy. Good boy, my bird. That's an old bird. That's our only adult so far. That's our only adult so far. Snows that are gonna be top, on top of us. Shoot the three. There you go. Nice long shooter, baby. I hope so. Dude, I, I saw that one. And I, I, saw, I went for that one too. Oh, yeah. yeah. That was awesome. Did we drop all three of those? Uh, we to kill four. That was awesome. Good boy. Here, dead bird. Fred, 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 here. Fred, Fred. Dead bird, dead bird. Alright, fix, fix some decoys. My bird. What? What? Here, Fred. Well, we just plucked uh, two juvies that were behind us, two juvie blues. They are really, really, really young, just completely gray, nasty, young birds. Uh, the morning's progressing here, and we're just picking away at the ones and threes, basically. Ones, twos, and three packs, juvies, that's what we're really chipping away at. Get ready. Get ready. Yep.
They floated way right. I was waiting for them to come back. Well, I want to show you my view. This is my view right here. That old Frederick. Am I part of your beautiful view? Yeah. Shoot the two or yeah. He got out fast. Fred got out there quick, let me tell you. Fred, man! Fred here. Dead bird, dead bird. Here we go. Good looking older bird there. Right here. Hi, bird. Sit. Good looking younger bird there. Right here on the right. On the right. In front. Get ready. get that long one down. I went after the long one and I didn't get him. Deborah. Hi bird. Dead bird. Well I think we're done. It's right at 9 30. The flight has really shut off but I want to show you the spread. Check it out way out back we got them scattered real big like real real big and then real thick where we're sitting here got family groups out front worked well they liked it decent i haven't got a count on what we shot yet but we're gonna get to picking this bad boy up and uh we'll look at our pile well <laughs> we're all done that took a uh, that took about an hour to get up roughly 200 does and that's what we put up today it was a blob but not a bad pile today not bad for kansas at all look at these gray birds oh young dirty birds 32 total not bad for the second day of conservation here in kansas i gotta say so myself we did pretty darn good what do you think was it better than what you thought yeah i think it was i think it was that was pretty good that was pretty good Took a lot of decoys, but yeah, we got did. up early. It did. We I'm glad up. we picked up when we did. Yeah, I'm glad we picked up. Three of these gentlemen got to go to school, so I'm like, hey, there's only, what, seven of us? I'm like, hey, we're picking up now. We ain't doing this with three or four people, so. Got her done, though. Got the trailer, the quad loaded down. Thanks for bringing your quad, too. Thanks, brother. Appreciate it. That was good. Was it better than what you thought? Uh thought we would do better. Really? Being yeah. a little stingy, huh? A little selfish. Yep. I don't know. For Compared to last year, I'm happy. Woo! I'm a little tired. Are you tired? I am. Dude, that was a lot of work. What time did you guys wake up? 3.15. 3.15. Yeah, I woke up at 3.50. Long morning, y'all. But like I've been saying, hunting season's coming to an end. Get out there while it's still, still here. If you haven't tried snow goose hunting, get out there. Try it, you know what I mean? Even if you don't have a ton of decoys, just get out there and give her a whirl. Well, little recap, little recap. The last two days, when we started snow goose hunting, we were planning this whole deal. Me and Preston always do this every year. Uh, I was like, man, I hope the next two days we hit a hundred birds and we didn't do it. We're close. I think uh, last two days, roughly 75 birds-ish, 70, 75 birds total last two days. So 
didn't hit that 100 benchmark right where I really wanted to be, but uh, the hunting was pretty good. Uh, for Kansas, and especially compared to last year, last year snow goose hunting, if all of you, any of you were subscribed to last year, boy howdy it was hard. I mean, you're talking you shot one or two, you know what I mean. So just like today, I think total out of the 32 birds, uh, maybe three or four, I think actually two or three were, were adult birds and everything else, 30 birds out of the 32 were indefinitely juvies. And there was some that were juvies that were so gray, so dark that it actually took me a while to call a shot on them because I thought they were specks forever because they were just so dirty and gray. Last year, 2018-19 season, we didn't have that option. Juvies were not around. They were definitely not in an abundance. And uh, that means you just didn't have decoy and birds. So again, take it uh, with a grain of salt. Guys, juvies, that's what you shoot. They're the ones that get low for you. The adults, you better uh, be hunting water. You better have something real tricky going on or something because we threw everything at them today and that's what we ended up with, you know? But I'm happy with it, very happy with it. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Oh, scared you, eh, not really, huh? Well, we're back home and uh, boy howdy, it is cold. Sitting at like 24 degrees right now, uh, north wind and sunny. But I wanna let you all know we have been getting after it. I have been chasing Whitey so much and we have done some epic hunts, y'all. We've shot some bands, we've shot uh, snow geese out of pit blinds. We've hunted snow geese over water. Uh, right now, I think I have four or five hunts that y'all haven't seen yet, and let me tell you, they're all bangers. So stick around for those, plus we're in the middle of moving. Oh, actually we start moving in a few days to the new house, to the new lodge, to the entire new property. I can't wait to show you guys that. It is indefinitely my dream home. We got to move the pigeons to the dream home. I'm calling it my dream home because it is truly my dream home. Stick around for those videos, but again, I hope you guys liked today's video. I hope you guys learned something from it. We, in fact, sat all of my snow goose decoys, which was 200 dozen. I, Wade and I, we have right at 200 dozen, and that's exactly what that spread was. Center of it was thick when we were, where we were laying, but everywhere around us was nothing but family strung out. I tried to make it as big as I could to take up as much of the field as I possibly could. Because we're on a rather small, narrow, long, but narrow field. And we're in the center of it. So I wanted to take up as much of that field as I could and it worked. But get out there if you haven't. There is some snow goose hunting left. Uh, it sounds like they're just now starting to get up to Squaw Creek area, Northwest Missouri. And they are just now, the first push is really coming through Kansas. The first push is about midway through. So if you're in Nebraska, South Dakota, Iowa, your hunting is yet to come. Just hold tight, they're on their way. Subscribe if you haven't. Hit that little notification bell down there because it will notify you when Fred and I upload. And, 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 if you guys want to help support the channel, you know what to do. Go down in the description, hit the Ducks Waterfowl link, see if there's a hat, a hoodie, some thermal sweats, something over there you might like because every one of your guys' purchases helps me bring you more of these videos. So, I mean it. I appreciate you all so much for being here, but until next time. I've been getting laid back, baby, you should know that I don't need your criticism, pessimism I've been keeping it on the DL, got a girl that keeps it real